Hello again, Andy with Handy Andy Handyman. And we are out today uh, on a property that we talk to people all the time who are landlords. And to be a landlord, you've gotta be tough. And if you're not, this is gonna happen. And the beautiful thing about, if you're a landlord or uh, a homeowner who's in trouble in a house and you wanna sell it, and it's in this kind of condition, it's really hard for you to see in here, the power's off on this property. The carpet is totally trash. It was new carpet. Uh, the tenant came through here. Uh, they've sprayed oil, stained the walls all over the place. Uh, they flooded the bathroom upstairs. It's gonna be kind of hard to see it in this area right here. See the shadowing right here? This all has to be cut and patched and then repopcorn and sprayed. So uh, what's happening in this, this project is fortunately for this homeowner, uh, they have a great agent, uh, Kizzy, who will be happy to put you in touch with who is able to offer them uh, the Real Vitalize program where this homeowner investor can go ahead and pay Handy Andy to make these repairs, go ahead and get all this work done and cleaned up. This is actually uh, vomit over here against the wall. It's all over through here. You can see the staining. Uh, it's everywhere. They've splattered oil and grease over everything. So all these walls have to be primed and painted the same with the ceiling here. This whole area down here, this whole ceiling will have to be sprayed and then spray primed, repaired, and then uh, spray painted. The only thing we'll spray in here is the ceilings. And the risk in doing that sometimes is popcorn will fall down if it's been damaged at all. Some of the areas you're not gonna be able to show you too well because they don't have power in here. Uh, but the beautiful thing about Kizzy's program is that she can go ahead and get these repairs, have us do these repairs, and the investor or homeowner will pay for these repairs at closing. Uh, it's really one of the few programs like it in the country. Uh, and Kizzy with Caldwell Banker is fortunate enough to be able to offer it uh, and then partner with a contractor like us to come in and just go ahead and get this done. Uh, so in a week's time, we can come through here, new paint, new carpet, clean it up uh, and get everything put back together again. I'll try to get a, a light upstairs here so you can see a little bit. But here in the carpet, they were actually burning incense in the carpet. Um, you can kind of see the grease stains on the walls right here. When you go upstairs, and again, it's dark, so I apologize for that. I'll try to get us a, a secondary light going here in a minute. There you go. So you can kind of see, see those dark stains on the wall right there? It's all just grease and nastiness. Um, this sink under here, you can kind of see the, if you see the bucket under the sink, they had a leak there for a long time, and that's what did in that ceiling downstairs. Where you've got purple walls like this, that's gonna take two coats of primer the walls are gonna have to be skimmed. It's kind of hard to see it, but they've sprayed stuff. It looks like spackle uh, or concrete on the wall. I'm not sure what that is, uh, but all this stuff is gonna have to be prime coated and then a coat of paint on top of it. Uh, in a room like this, this is gonna take two coats of primer to cover this stuff in this room. It's really hard to see the color. It's kind of like a super dark, Teal, blue green, one coat of primer won't cover this. And they got it up in the ceiling too, so we're gonna have to prime that stuff out. But the beautiful thing is you'll be able to come back through and this place will show like brand new. New paint, new carpet. Uh, you can kind of get a feel for the walls. They had another leak with the HVAC right here. See that? It kind of looks like a, a runniness. I'm sorry the camera's having a real hard time pulling this up. Um, one of these doors, I forget which one, but one of the walls or doors has vomit all over it. Uh, nice, nice size rooms. I mean, once it's cleaned up, it'll be great. This wall right here, this door right here, that's vomit. They just left it. So if you're a landlord and you're stuck in a situation like this, instead of selling your property cheap to just get out and, and run away, you can actually partner with somebody like Kizzy and go ahead and get the house sold for top dollar. Uh, we've done four or five of these with her here lately. And every one of them is sold for above market listing uh, and they've sold immediately. So the key is to turn it, clean it up, have it ready to go. And it's simple stuff. Just pull these blinds down, they're trash. You can go ahead and leave the plastic clips because the next person is going to install them or we'll take them down and patch the holes. It doesn't matter. You can see the condition of the house if you see all the, the debris on the fan. We'll give you a real feel for it. They've broken a couple of, of doors here and there and we've noted that. We got a lot of stenciling in these walls. It all has to come down. Some of it's paint, some of it's stickers. 
we're used to this. I mean, we do a project like this once a week. Um, this kind of a, a color here, same thing. It's going to take two coats to cover the primer. They never finished it. Uh, so two coats of tinted primer. Uh, and then we're going to have to sand and skim a lot of this stuff out. I don't know what they've got going on these walls, but every bedroom is like this in here. we got a little bit of damage up here uh, from the HVAC. You can kind of see that discoloration there. And the trick with that is you can actually see it where the popcorn is pulling away. Builders use this finish because it's cheap, it's easy, but they don't prime the drywall underneath. So once it gets any moisture like that, it just starts falling away. Sometimes we can fix it easy, sometimes we can't. Uh, sometimes in a room like this, we end up just scraping it and, and uh, smooth finishing the whole ceiling just because it's, it's more cost effective. But we always try to do it on the cheaper end. You can see back here in this wall is mostly head sweat and grease. But they, they've made a heck of a mess in here. So if you happen to find yourself in this particular situation, don't get frustrated and run out and, and get with, you know, Open Door or one of these other programs or an investor group that, you know, we buy cheap houses. And that's how those guys thrive. There are times where it, it, someone is immediately desperate for cash and they need to close in a day. And, you know, those types of, of programs may, may fit your particular situation. But if you've got 30 days, you're always going to be much better off to get with somebody of Kizzy with the Real Vitalize program and call a banker and go ahead and clean this thing up, paint it with a nice neutral color, new neutral carpet. It'll show great. It'll sell immediately. Uh, the last one we did for her, she had seven offers before she even listed the house. So it was absolutely crazy. Uh, she's a, a machine in terms of getting deals done. Just a great person. So if you need her help, let us know. We've got agents all over the metro Atlanta area that can help you. Just let us know, you know, where you're listing and, and what your situation is. Just be patient. Getting me on the phone is hard. I'm not just a salesman. I work with my guys. Uh, and I'm tired, honestly. I'm, I'm running all over the place. So getting me on the phone can be a little bit tough. Uh, you can try us in the office at 770-912-2829. Uh, or sometimes you can get to me directly at 770-265-9017. My brother and I run a crew of 20-some people. It, it goes up or down. Uh, here the last year, we've had an awful hard time getting quality workers to stick. Uh, it's just they get paid and, and uh, they're waiting for that next government check. has been a real problem. We train a lot of our guys, uh, but it, it's, it's really hard to get good quality workers. And so my brother and I run these jobs. We're on them every day, uh, especially with this Real Vitalize program. Uh, any of these programs, either myself or my brother will be on the project every day. Um, but we pretty much do everything from paint to carpet to electrical plumbing, any kind of drywall repairs, a lot of kitchen and baths, a lot of basements. You name it, we do it. We're a one call does all. Uh, we'll keep you posted on this project because you'll get this one going right away. Uh, and I would expect to see a, a finished video in a week or two, depending on where we're able to start it. I'm Andy. See you at the next house. Bye for now.